Teresa! What a surprise! What are you doing here? Timothy! I don't believe it! I'm going to see my daughter. She will marry this weekend. How about you? I'm going to visit my parents. When is your daughter's wedding? Sunday. Wow! This Sunday is the 45th wedding anniversary of their wedding, too. This is a surprise. Anyway, where is your train leaving from? My train leaves from Platform 3, over there. How long will you... Now leaving from Platform 3, train for Vancouver. That's my train! I have to run. Sorry we didn't have more time to talk. That's okay. I'll see you when you get back. Have a good time, and say congratulations to your parents. Raymond! Oh, hi Grace. How have you been? Good. I hear you've been in Toronto for a few days. Yes, I just got back yesterday. Did you have a nice visit? Really nice. It was very good for going around downtown and shopping. And I saw the Toronto Blue Jays game at Sky Dome. I see that Toronto is a very exciting city. My brother Stanley was there, too. You've met Stanley, haven't you? Sure. I met him when he was here in Hamilton last year. What's he doing these days? Still teaching baseball? Yes. As a matter of fact, he just began to teach elementary school. Great! How's everything with his kids? Have you met my nieces? Yes, they visit you once in the summer, didn't they? Right. They're both fine. I haven't seen them in a long time. They must be really big. Well, they will come over this Christmas. Let's have a great Christmas party together. That's a good idea! Did you hear about the Smith family? No. What happened? Mrs. Smith passed away this morning. That's a shame. What from? Heart attack, I think. That's a terrible thing. Yes. Mrs. Smith went into the hospital last night by ambulance and died this morning. Had she been suffering from heart disease? Yeah. Mrs. Smith had it for five years before she died. Did they try surgery? <sighs> she had two operations, but they weren't effective. I feel sorry for Mr. Smith. Have you heard about the good news in the Wallace family? No, I've been out of town. Mrs. Wallace went into the hospital last night and gave a birth to a baby girl seven hours later. That's very good, but they already have a little girl, don't they? No, they have a five-year-old boy. So they wanted a girl this time, right? Yes, they wanted a girl for a long time. Was it a natural childbirth? No, she had to have a C-section. Do you like my new coat? It looks terrific. I'm glad you like it. How much was it? Eighty dollars. That's a good price. 
Yeah, it was on sale. Where did you get it? At Sears. I like to shop there too. They always have really good sales. Maybe you should go there today. They have a sale on the shirt if you're interested. Good idea! I need some. What a beautiful day. Yes. There's not a cloud in the sky. What's the temperature? It's at 70 degrees. I love October. Me too. It's not too hot and not too cold. Fall is my favorite season. Mine too. The weather is almost perfect. And the leaves are very pretty when they change colors. Is it cold out? Yes, it's cold and windy. I'm going to wear a heavy coat. Good idea. Where are you going? To the post office. Why? To mail this package. Would you buy some stamps for me? Sure. How many do you want? Ten. Here's the money for the stamps. Okay. I'll be back in twenty minutes unless I get blown away. Do you like snow? No, I hate it. Why? Snow is so pretty. Yes, but I don't like to drive in it. Well, it's beginning to snow. And I have to drive to work. How far is it to work? Six miles. Are we going to get a lot of snow? About twelve inches, they say. Oh no! Driving will be dangerous. Please be careful. I will. By the way, can I borrow your car? When is your vacation? It starts next week. Where are you going? We're renting a house on the shore. That's wonderful! Yes, we love the ocean. Do you swim a lot? Not very much. Then why are you going to the shore? Because we all bought new swimsuits. <laughs>